Howdy 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 my beautiful Capricorn, how are you doing darling? My name is Simply Valka and today I'm going to be getting into your weekly tarot reading Capricorn for July darling. So if you enjoy this tarot reading here today, I'll let you in on a secret darling. Click on the top right hand corner right here darling and you'll be taken to your monthly tarot reading. And let me know in the comments below how my tarot readings help you out Capricorn. That's how I keep up with you guys in the comments and I always, always enjoy hearing from y'all. I just bit my cheek right now if you're wondering what just happened there. <laughs> uh capricorn also i really appreciate it for those that take the extra steps to give this tarot video a like and subscribe it really helps me out a lot and thank you to those that do that if you want to support me i would appreciate it it's completely free to do all right capricorn so today we're going to be getting into three tarot rows for you here all right remember capricorn that to it's important for you to consume more than just your one zodiac sign all right to consume your sun moon rising as well as your venus sign capricorn okay now, for your first row today, Capricorn, we're going to be covering over your financial as well as your career situation. For your second row, Capricorn, today we're going to be covering over your social life here. All right, this could be family, platonic, romantic, what have you, someone in the workplace. And in the third row, which is my personal favorite row, Capricorn, we're going to be getting into your tarot predictions here, what's going to be happening for you, and also just some tarot messages to bring some guidance, bring some clarity of what's happening for you but to start your energy out here today uh capricorn we have here the two uh not the two darling the magician energy stepping forward to you all right the second major arcana i suppose uh the magician energy capricorn the, you uh are very potent at this time here all right what I want to do is really celebrate you guys currently, Capricorn, because I feel as if if you're not hearing it from me or or from any from the outside, if you're not getting outside validation for this Capricorn, you might be even asking yourself the question of being like, oh, like, am I being like too full of myself? Am I expecting too much or what have you here, Capricorn? Some really powerful stuff is about to be getting manifested for you here. And it's through your own ability. It's through your own manifestation work maybe you've been journaling maybe you just been putting the intent out there capricorn but there's a lot of positive things that are going to be happening in your life and it's because you earned it all right and so why i feel the need just to like gas you up capricorn is because it's like some of you guys might be asking yourself the question because you're just like oh am i worthy of this am i deserving of this um some of you got you know that imposter syndrome however that manifests for you but it's just like no darling you've worked really hard for this all right capricorn so keep your head up and just be ready to receive these blessings only thing that will stop you from receiving these blessings fully capricorn is by you uh, uh shifting your mindset is by you not accepting these things it's like you can't be asking the universe why uh something's happening instead just say thank you practice that gratitude and a lot more is going to come towards you all right but really excited about what's about to be manifesting for you remember that this magician energy is going to be complementing all three tarot decks here or all three rows here capricorn all right girl we'll just leave it like that let's get into your first row now with your career and financial situation being the empress king of pentacles with the six of wands stepping forward to you all right so you got my favorite minor arcana card that six of wands capricorn that's a w in my book honey all right this is the fame and fortune right that's what it's known as all right you're going to be noticing uh, your hard work getting recognized all right the six of wands represents public recognition your manager your bosses are going to be noticing your hard work and then i see with the king of pentacles and empress energy some of you guys are having the opportunity of a promotion coming in here because i get the sense of more responsibility the opportunity to have more responsibility put on you some of you this manifests more so just as in this way of like finding yourself with again like the surplus of like uh more financial means coming to you like getting more money coming in here and just setting you up for stability here all right empress energy this is the creation energy here this is an energy of how people are perceiving you which is very beautiful uh people perceive you in this way capricorn of where it's like the life events that you go through what it is that you're able to do it's like they acknowledge the natural talent that you have because you do have that natural talent capricorn what it is that you do not everyone can do how easy it comes to you is not as easy as it comes for everybody else capricorn so you need to guys you need to give yourself more credit where credit is due credit yourself darling all right 
again things are really manifesting for you in such a beautiful way at this time continue putting in the hard work at this time i get for some of you capricorns the biggest struggle for you is not to getting too consumed with what it is that you're currently seeing all right some of you guys are currently experiencing some type of drought some of you guys are currently feeling like you're not being appreciated capricorn some of you feel as if like it's pointless for you to work hard because you're not going to get what it is that you deserve that's not the case all right keep putting in the work capricorn you feel as if no one is watching but in fact it's quite the opposite everyone is watching and you are going to get benefits from that tapping into your social life now capricorn you have the three of wands six of pentacles with the page of wands as well darling all right we're tapping into a social reading for you capricorn where new energy is coming in here you're going to be having someone new approaching you you already have seen signs of them capricorn all right you've seen signs of them where it's like they might be wearing something that reminds you of something or someone from beforehand or some they exude some type of nostalgic trait to you or just in general they're going to feel pretty nostalgic to you capricorn because this is someone that has like their presence has been is familiar to you all right for some of you capricorns this familiar presence is because they've been like in the same environments as you have but maybe the same circle social circles but they never approached you here all right but something's going to be happening this week capricorn that brings you and this person's path and together and starts intertwining here all right and there's this again i keep on getting like this me message of nostalgia that you're going to be experiencing with this person all right and i feel like this is a really valuable connection here capricorn i feel like this connection is going to have a lot more substance in the sense of um just like a connection just to connect with them i feel like this person either inspires something in you motivates you in some way capricorn this person this person's presence does something than more than just like in a social dynamic of just having like a friend does that make sense this person plays an impact in some way here to help with some type of passionate goal to help towards feed into this magician energy for you here even take note this lover's energy as well Mm -hmm. stepping in afterwards so just like yeah really pleasant energies here when it comes to your social life what i also want to be pointing out capricorn is the six of pentacles being the heart of your spread here all right the six of pentacles being the heart of the spread is things coming back into balance that were out of balance beforehand all right capricorn so that's what's really happening for many of you guys when it comes to your career also that i want to be pointing out is that the hard work that you've been putting in it's been so lopsided for now because you've been putting on so much and really no, the other side hasn't been putting anything in it's it's going to be start balancing itself out whether this come manifests through career and financial situations for you capricorn or whether this manifests through relationships in your life where you're always the one constantly extending out communication and not getting uh, anything of substance back here all right now in your third row here you have the king of cups page of pentacles with the pa uh, two of wands stepping forward to you capricorn it's really interesting the uh, cards that you got this week here all right what i see for you capricorn is in terms of a financial situation for you i see contracts coming in here two of wands talks about long term into the future contract signing a contract for a higher position for some of you guys page of pentacles that's a new stream of revenue coming in here for you as well Capricorn, you're going to be having the opportunity of, um, or you have the strong opportunity, the strong ability, Capricorn, to manifest, to create a new stream of revenue here, right? So whether you if you have been sitting on some type of business idea, I see public recognition coming in from that. All right, you would be getting recognized. You wouldn't be just creating content and no one's seeing it. You wouldn't be starting that Etsy store and no one's noticing it here. King of Cups energy, the mature, the emotional maturity coming in here. All right, people in your life, you're going to start noticing being a lot more much emotionally mature towards you. Some people have been acting extremely irrational around you, Capricorn, and they've been, been projecting that onto you. King of Cups energy is letting me know if, uh, emotions are starting to stabilize and mature. All right, people are no longer going to start projecting their issues onto you all right you're no longer going to be having to deal with like um landmines essentially here i don't know why that mess is needed to come in here all right but be expecting communication from people as well 
all right i feel like in a social dynamic for you capricorn the people that do try to connect with you capricorn it has some substance there with that two of wands all right it's not just like a surface level super vapid type of dynamic here it's something or just the connection itself will be something that has the potential to have some longevity all right so let's start clarifying these rows now capricorn remember we're going to start out with your career which was the empress six of wands and king of pentacles here we're going to do one bridge shuffle here mm -mm. Uh -uh. ace of swords eight of wands coming in here with the high priestess energy seven of cups in the back of the deck stepping in here capricorn i see you guys sitting on this is what i was saying like y'all are sitting on some pretty good ideas um here and you just gotta take action on one of them you just gotta take movement on one of them here all right eight of wands you have to not be afraid of experimenting with these creative ideas all right eight of wands represents one first and foremost talks about movement but it also talks about trying out each wand seeing one which one fits the best for you and y'all need to trust your intuition with this here capricorn all right a lot of you guys are doubting yourself and just dismissing certain ideas as just like fairy tales or just like whatever playing make-believe or whatever but the reality is capricorn is just like if you were to give yourself more credit and willing to bet your a bet on some of these ideas invest in some of the these ideas here be really valuable here even with the seven of cups it's the sense of experimentating rather than trying to grow something that it's like instead of trying to further advance current situations in your life capricorn focus more on trying to expound trying to expand on what you currently already have and dipping your hands in multiple pots capricorn all right now in your second row for your social life remembering it was the three of wands six of pentacles with that page of wands we have the emperor energy coming in here the eight of cups stepping forward as well as the world card coming in and then we have the queen of cups coming in response here as i was saying beforehand you have that king of cups energy capricorn that is really just bringing this sense of emotional maturity coming in here i want to be saying for some of y'all in your social life coming in here you're going to be finding like either you're going be getting closer with your partner in crime whether this is a best friend your lover or what have you or just like your twin basically it's like your twin um really connecting with them i see sibling connections really developing better as well for some of you capricorns <clears throat> now world energy eight of cups emperor energy coming in here capricorn i feel like for you here this is speaking about while it's like you have some situation new energy trying to approach you trying to connect with you here this now starts coming in as a sense for you it's like i see you capricorn coming into this place of walking away from stuff that's been very unfulfilling to you and putting a closure to the, those chapters i feel like for you capricorn it's no longer the sense of having a conversation with certain people it's like for you you're just sitting in this place capricorn in of uh where you're just like you know what i'm gonna do me i'm gonna do me i'm gonna put my focus on me and any relationship that suffers any social relationship i don't hear from any people i don't hear from you are putting the responsibility on them because i see for you you're just going to be about your business more so now capricorn like i just get the sense of you're just tired of trying you're tired of trying so hard with so many connections and that not being matched with you so it's just like for you you're just getting distant you're just like you know what i'm hands off from it you know we can pick this back up at a later point in time but i'm not going to be the one to pick this up all right it's not enough is what i hear it's not enough and even like even when you might have noticed capricorn i did this and i guess i always do talk with my hands this looks weird actually now that i'm talking about it but it's just like i wanted to shake so it's almost like the sense like the emphasis of shaking so it's just like shaking for you where it's just like you've thought with this to the point of like driving you mad where it's like some pe certain people have just like drove you mad capricorn with like how much you thought about that like i don't know it's just like when when i said it's not enough it's just like I don't know it's just like you 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 snapped i don't know i don't know how to i wish i could just like show you guys uh, express properly how i don't know anyways let's just move on i'm probably just coming off as weird anyways capricorn let's clarify your third row now 
Remembering it was the Page of Pentacles, Two of Wands, and King of Cups coming, coming in. Knight of Swords coming in here, Queen of Cups coming right back out, Two of Pentacles, Seven of Wands stepping forward here, Capricorn, all right? You're going to be noticing as you go on your journey here, um, don't allow outside people to instill doubt on your journey currently, Capricorn. Don't allow outside people to gaslight you and don't allow, don't take on other people's burdens where it's not your burden to take on. All right. Don't take on other people's burdens where it's not your burden to take on. And sometimes those burdens are people's projections of you. All right. It's not your burden. It, just because someone else thinks you're a bitch and whatever, you're a diva, or whatever, that's not your burden to bear. That's how they perceive you. You don't, just because they perceive you in that way, that's how they're perceiving you because you're just minding your own business you're just doing your own thing but it's not your job to change how they see you you need to be more like it take it take it or leave it it is what it is energy and just not fighting all right it's this sense for you capricorn i feel like a lot of you guys are starting to become a lot more indifferent towards a lot of things in your life that's it's like this sense for you it's just like it's no longer serving you it is what it is. You're no longer fighting with the flow of the universe. It's just very much so for you, Capricorn. You're just like, you know what? I'm tired. I'm no longer trying to like force situ situations to happen, force relationships to happen. You're tired. If it's meant to happen, it'll come to you, right, Capricorn? So this is the weekly tarot reading that I have for you, darling Capricorn. All right, remember, darling, if you enjoyed this, I promise you, I promise you, darling, you'll like this reading up here, darling, top right-hand corner of your screen. Give this video a like and subscribe. Again, if you enjoy this tarot reading, if you want to book a private one with me, Capricorn, my website's linked down below, Simply Falcon. Dot com. Next to my social medias, TikTok and Instagram, if you'd like to connect with me on a more intimate level, Capricorn, the links are down below as well. Uh, simply Velka, same as here, darling. But until next time, Capricorn, I love you so much and hopefully I can connect with you sometime in the near future, darling. Bye, Capricorn.